So you're about to see a case with a woman who has a cervical fusion in her neck and she was in a car accident four years ago, had after the accident, as a matter of fact immediately after the accident, numbness down her arm into her two fingers. We know that comes from the lower cervical upper thoracic spine. She had a cervical fusion, four screws and four vertebrae. She'd seen a chiropractor prior, she was terrified to go to a chiropractor had been living with the numbness, the tingling in her hands, the pain in her upper back, her neck for years, it was referred to me through a network of people, flew out here from Philadelphia for five days of treatment, twice a day, and what you're about to see is her getting adjusted, and we're gonna show you her x-ray as well. And what I want you to note in this video is that it's very specific what we're doing, and so if chiropractic's not specific, it's really not chiropractic and the benefit and the um, the ability of the body to heal and the benefit of the adjustment comes in the specificity of correcting the specific vertebrae that's out of alignment and in Carol's case you'll see that when we adjust her her eyes get wide she breathes and she comes into the sensation of knowing oh this is what I've been looking for and that's the biggest gift for me. It's the biggest blessing to serve and it's the biggest blessing to see the lights go on when people realize that they can be healthy and they don't have to live with pain and don't have to suffer. So what we have with Carol is a cervical fusion over four levels, C4, 5, 6, and 7. This is from back to front, right side, left side. And when we look here, and get a more clear picture the screw is going into the C4, C5, C6, C7 vertebrae metal holding it together and she's got limited motion when we check her motion moving forward, motion moving backwards you see how limited her extension is. You see when she flexes forward it moves fairly well. We've uh, analyzed it further but just for purposes here showing you that she's losing the cervical curve, these vertebrae don't move and then when we come back again to alignment, she's well out of alignment and so specific chiropractic adjusting always indicated and helping bring her back into alignment. Push towards the middle. Okay, and eyes over here to the right. Push. Okay, and hands down. We're going to breathe in nice and deep. And out. Head relaxed. Right there. Mm. Amazing. <laughs> yes. Hands here again. Turn your arms this way. Eyes to the right. Just the eyes. Push. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. Eyes up and to the left. Here. Push. Excellent. Straight to the left. Push. Excellent. Hands down. Head relax. Yeah. Arms on your tummy. Breath in and out. Mm. Oh, wow. That's great. It's big. Yeah. It's smoother it's and smooth deeper. And nice, yeah. Much deeper. Yes, much better than this. Like, it's just every day better, 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 better. Every time, yes. right? Yes. So good, thank you. Yes, ma'am. Now go ahead and come on to your. Tell me for a second. Let's go to my two And push this leg back. Push, push. I'm going to have you lay on your left side, dear. Shoulders relaxed. Gonna lean over. 
if you can go on this one, shoulders to this. Just on the shoulders, yeah. You're fine right there. Right there. Mm. A little different, a little deeper on that one, my face up. Mm -hmm. Tighten the abs, hands here. Fourth adjustment? Fourth, yeah. Amazing. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <Cut> there. <laughs> 